the girl. And then she came to the realization that no matter how the child was born, we were going to love it anyway. How many of you understand? So, hence this is why Elizabeth's here. She's the one that sings for us. She's the one that leads us to worship. And she is the one that runs around the house. In fact, just to be, the story is, Elizabeth was walking at nine months old. Okay, so where everybody takes a little while. Elizabeth was one of them that learned how to walk and we couldn't hold her down. <laughs> but, and, and if you if you know, if you if you have anything to do with Sprint, Sprint is, is able to continue on because of Elizabeth. <laughs> and this is true. Amen. Thank you for family packages. <laughs> but and then I see, you know, um, you know, we, we, we live life and, and every day we have to treasure it. How many people know that? We have to treasure every single day that we live. Amen. Especially with your children. And I'll tell you a little sad story we heard this week of a family from New York. And I don't know if you've seen the news where there was a person, there was a person in Newark, New Jersey that lost a child for a person that was speeding down the block and kill the child of five years old. Well, we know the family. We know the family, the family, it's a pastoral family there in Bronx, in the Bronx, New York. And, and sad to say, they also lost a grandchild several years ago. And this is the second grandchild that you lose. So I want you to understand that if you have a child, if you have a child, childs make mistakes. People, child, children make mistakes. You gotta love them every single day because you don't know if tomorrow you won't have them. You understand that? Man. So this is the reason why I, I, I desire for everybody to look at their child and say, you know, honey, it don't have to be your birthday for me to tell you I love you. It doesn't have to be Christmas. It doesn't have to be New Year's. It doesn't have to be even a wedding to tell you they love you. One thing I can tell you about Elizabeth is that every time she speaks to me, and she hangs up the phone, she says, I love you. So, and I always love her back. I want to tell you that, you know, on my behalf, on, on um, the Falciano's behalf, and, and the Ramos' behalf, because I know, I know Ishmael's father and mother, and they are tremendous missionaries and men, men of God and a woman of God that I know where their family line is. So uh, I'm happy, I'm happy that um, I'm giving Elizabeth into the hands of a, a, you know, I know for a fact, a man of God. Okay, now, we all have to pray for their ministry, am I right? We have to pray, pray for their ministry, so that God can just enlighten them and, and lead them to the ministry that they desire and that they have in their lives. So when their little Elizabeth's come around, and little Ishmael's come around, amen, and little Giges come around, Amen. Half Brazilian, half New Yorican. <laughs> so, we just want to pray for them. Am I right? As, 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 you know, and everybody that's here that's married know that it's not easy. How many people with me? How many people with me? Those who want to get married, it's not easy. But it's possible. It's possible. If you stop looking at the imperfection of the person that's next to you and start looking at the perfection that God is in, the, in them, then you start to learn that you can live with that person. Am I speaking to somebody? Because we always watch, the enemy always wants you to watch the imperfections. But God wants you to write, oh, see what? The perfections. So put a ring on that girl. Shout out. Patterson people, thank you. Those are my family members, you know, you know members of the council, uh, thank you, uh, Brother Max and you know, Ruben and Minerva and all the brothers from Church of God Philadelphia. Oh, I see that being God bless you, thank you. Amen. Praise God, hallelujah. Faith Church of God, amen. Praise God. Amen. And I thank praise God. Let me let me thank also praise God Carla. Carla, I want to thank you. 
woman. Chu, how many people want to thank Chu Chu? Hallelujah for what she's done. Megan and all of them that are out there and Hillary and. Oh, Megan was here yesterday. No, Hillary was here. That's Hillary. Hey, Amen. Hillary. Hillary, praise God. I can't tell them the difference anyway, but. Megan! That's Megan? You see, I was right the first. That's Hillary. 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 Amen. Thank you for the people from the Bronx. Amen. Praise. Oh, no. Here comes trouble. Praise God, but Pastora Carmen cooked the rest of the meal.